Good morning. <clears throat> it is, if you can see that, it's 10 past three. What a lovely time to be up. 10 past three, it's the 15th of October, 2022. I have to say I'm feeling pretty groggy. Uh, gotta be up early though, because I need to be, um, I need to be in Bournemouth for uh, for today's race um, at half past six. I need to catch a bus from the finishing line to the start line for a 50k. So first time I've ever done a 50k race. Not really sure what to expect. I've only done three marathons, so um, I don't know what I'm thinking signing up to this. Anyway, I thought I'd record a few thoughts before I do it. Might be useful for somebody else that's doing one at some point. So the plan is um, get to Bournemouth, half six. Well, forget all the logistics. The race starts at eight. And it's a pretty flat course, apparently. Point to point, starting at Ringwood and making its way through the New Forest eventually to uh, Bournemouth. Um, so I did, a, I did a marathon three weeks ago in 3, 43, 48. So average pace of 5, 19 per kilometer. Um, probably should have run it a little, paced it a little bit differently. I went out way too fast. Did about 30k. Page dropped off and uh, then we got slower and slower and slower. So this time I think I'm going to just take it easy. I'm not going for a massively fast time. I think if I can get around five hours, I'll be happy. Course elevation for this one is pretty flat. I think it's only 300 meters or so across the whole course. So that should make it uh, relatively gentle on the legs. Um, and it's 50% on tarmac and 50% on trails. So they've advised road shoes. So I'm just gonna stick on the Nike Vapor Flies and hopefully, yeah, we'll see what happens. So the goal, the goal is running around, I don't know, 5.45 per kilometer, maybe even a bit slower. I just gotta rein the ego in and think of it as a five hour run rather than a, um, sure to run, just try and rein myself in. There's four stops en route with chip mats and um, medical assistance, toilets, water, packets of crisps, all sorts of food apparently. So um, hopefully I won't get cramps and be uh, too salt deficient. And I've got a couple of um, a couple of bags that I'm dropping off on aid stations three and four. So I've just put a couple of gels and um, a packet of salty crisps in a in a Loctite bag. Stick my number on it, and they should be available for me to pick up at the aid stations. Uh, yeah, that's that's all I can think of to say at the moment. Um, I'll catch up with you probably next shot will be of me milling around in Bournemouth, so wish me luck. All right, we're at the start. We've just been dropped off by the coach. It's uh, 20 past seven, starts in half an hour. So uh, I'll check in with you. I've got a few kilometers under my belt. So, just over 10k in. Uh, it's quite a nice run actually. It's quite cool. There's a bit of mist. It's dry, not, not too windy. Fairly flat. Uh, so I'm just taking it easy at the moment. So I can see what I've got in the tank later on. Doing about 5.40 pace. Probably a little bit faster than I should be going, but I'll slow down a bit. Anyway, catch up with you later on. I've just gone through the half marathon uh, checkpoint. Uh, 
So I've done 21.1 k's in two hours and three minutes. So that's kind of the pace I was aiming for, around 5.50 per kilometer. Uh, hip flexors are feeling quite weak. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna be able to carry on. Let's just see how it goes. It's been a lovely day, nice and cool, mainly dry. Lots of uh, encouragement on the way. Good so far. 26 and a half K in, 23 and a half to go. Started opening up, uh, the rain has come down, heavens have opened. So just putting a waterproof on. Uh, my hip flexors are shot. So I'm just uh, walking for a bit. If it doesn't clear up, don't feel much better then I shall probably just uh, get a taxi back to the car. So there it goes. So the rain stopped. Uh, I am exhausted. I'm struggling. So just walking up a hilly bit. Done 30.5 kilometers in three hours and three minutes. So but I'm slowing down enormously now so I might have to do some walking, some jogging. Uh, because I did Goodwood Marathon three weeks ago, I don't think I fully recovered yet. Legs are heavy, the hip flexors, especially the left, really are weak. So, you know, there's my excuses. I'll keep plodding along, I'll catch up with you later. Right, so this is the aid station 32 and a half. I'm just stopping to have some food. Legs are shot, so I'm just going to take it easy. See you later. Thirty-six point six. I'm done. My hip is painful, so I'm going to get a cab. That's me done.